Ladies and gentlemen, FIFA 23 is officially out, so let's get started! For cheap, safe and reliable FIFA 23 coins, make sure to check out the best place on the market, u7buy.com, to get your coins within 10 minutes and don't forget to use my discount code Crossy. And guys, for cheap game codes and prepaid Xbox and PlayStation cards, G2A is the place for you. Check the link down below. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, FIFA 23, EA Sports, FIFA 23, I'm so freaking excited. I'm so freaking excited, EA Sports. To the game, it's in the game, let's go on Mbappe. The official cover of FIFA 23 once again. Guess who's the best player in FIFA 23, guys? Mbappe without any doubt. So let's go, guys, in the first ever game that I'm going to play. In FIFA 23, okay, those are the new menus. So we've got Pro Clubs, Ultimate Team Play Modes, okay, Customize. I'm going to talk about settings uh, and everything else, guys. Tomorrow and the day after tomorrow, I'm going to create so many dedicated tutorials about absolutely everything. Shooting, finishing, settings, passing, defending, skill moves. Absolutely everything will be covered by me on my YouTube channel. Now, play modes. This is my first game ever, guys. Remember, I didn't play the beta. I didn't play any early access versions of FIFA 23. So I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to share with you guys my honest opinion on FIFA 23 right now. And I'm going to compare it to FIFA 22. So I'm going to do a kick of game, okay? And the theme that, team that I'm going to use will be, I don't know, I don't know. Advance. Yes, I want to play advance. Okay, advance again. Come on, let's go, man. So I'm going to go with, I don't know, ready? Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. So, classic match, no specific rules. And the team that I'm going to select will be, you know what? Let's go with Mbappe, PSG, Messi also, guys. I'm gonna go with PSG and let's play against Kareem the Dream, the future Golden Ball winner, guys. So let me go Spain. Let me find Spain, actually. Where is Spain? Spain. Come on. Madrid. There we go. I'm gonna go with the blue kit versus the official white kit for Real Madrid team management, guys. The only thing that I'm going to do right now will be... Okay, I'm Papi Striker. Nene on the left, Messi on the right. GG. So we've got five at the back. I don't... Bro, the default formation of PSG is five at the back. What? So I'm going to go with four, two, three, one, narrow, guys. Wait, I'm Papi Striker. Okay, we've got Messi, Cam, Nene on the left. On the right, we've got one second. Renato Sanchez in for sure, guys. Alongside Verratti. Pereira, Marquinhos, Ramos, Hakimi at the back, Donna, Roma in goal, and I just want to I just wanna change my right winger, but who am I supposed to put, guys, at that position? I don't know. By the way, Mendes in. I'm not going to use Pereira. Anyways, right winger. You know what? I'm going to do something else. Mukiele, right fullback, and we've got Hakimi on the right wing. Hakimi has incredible stats, 92 pace, so... I'm pretty sure that he will get the job done. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. First ever game. Come on, let's go. So, guys, let's talk about the game. Let me check the graphics. The first and the most important thing that I want to check out are the new graphics. I'm currently playing the PlayStation 5 new gen version, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm not going to skip anything. You know what? I just want to check player faces and anything else. The first thing that I just noticed, the pitch is upgraded, guys. You can see the colors. The colors of the of the pitch are much better compared to FIFA 22. Let's talk about player faces. I don't know what to say because player faces were already really good, guys. In FIFA 22, even in FIFA 21. Also in FIFA 23, maybe, maybe a bit better, guys. It's so hard for me to notice a difference, to be honest. Mbappe. Let's go, Mbappe. Kareem the Dream. Okay. Beautiful. 
Absolutely beautiful. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Thibaut Courtois, Danny Cavajal, Rudiger, the new addition of Real Madrid. Let's go. Love it, guys. Love the graphics. Especially if you play the game on a big 4K TV. Just imagine it, guys. The quality of the graphics is top-notch. There is nothing I can say against the graphics in FIFA 23. But now, the tasty part begins. Let's talk about the gameplay. Because, guys, let's be honest. If we talk about the gameplay, sometimes it's better to not say anything. So, yeah, guys, look at the pitch, man. The green color. Oh, yo, 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 yo. It's so, it's so green, right? <laughs> So much different compared to FIFA 22. One second, boys. Training center off. Okay, camera cop. Just prepared my settings as well. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's play. Come on. Okay. Renato Sanchez. Hakimi. Boom. Come on, Mbappe. Mbappe, bro. Official cover. You need to score goals. Oh, what a mistake. And that's number one. Oh, did you guys see it? Okay, that's something new. That's something new in FIFA 20. Three guys. Focus, Crossy. Focus, focus, focus. Let's go. Bye-bye. Messi. Messi is a bit slower compared to FIFA 22. But I'm pretty sure that he's still one of the best possible camps that you can use in FIFA 23. What a save from Thibaut Courtois, guys. Okay, that's something new, guys. The way you are performing the corner kicks. La pa okay. In the next days, I'm going to create a tutorial. By the way, by using the right stick, you can you can apply curve to the ball. I'm going to use the knuckle ball now. Is it gonna work? Oh, almost. Let's go. Come on. Boom. Mbappe. Mbappe, bow row. Mbappe, that finish, bro. That finish, bro. We go up by two goals, minute eight. What's the difficulty? I don't know. I don't know if I'm too good. And that's my first game of FIFA 23 or the difficulty of the AI is low. Whew. What just happened? I don't know. Okay, Verratti, let's go. Bank, bank, bank. Great pass. Mendes, Mendes, the post. Let me try the crossing now. Get cross. Very good goalkeeping afterwards. Look at the goalkeeper movement, by the way, guys. After catching the ball, great reflexes. New animations. This is the first thing that I just noticed, guys. New animations added to FIFA 23. Let's go, Mbappe. Finesse from distance. Finesse from distance. Easy safe. Okay. Finesse shots from distance. They just feel different compared to FIFA 22. Passing is also different, guys. The way the ball is moving on the field is different. Definitely different. But I love it. I actually love it. Let's go, Nene. Boom. Neymarcito. Neymarcito. Let me try the rainbow flick. Uh, skill move. Oh, what a safety ball. The cross. Bro, seriously, did I expect Messi to win the header? Messi to score header? Okay, Crossy. Good luck. Hakimi. Boom. Messi. Messi. Okay. Very good dribbling, but that's messy. When you guys press the L1 button, Messi keeps the ball very close to his feet and dribble with the ball. But we are going to talk about dribbling, tutorials, and so on in the upcoming episodes on my YouTube channel. Let's go! Neymarcito! We make it 3-0, minute 21. GG Crossy. Let's go, boom, boom, Verratti, Nene, Mbappe, let's go. Ooh, that shot and that finish, uh, that goalkeeping afterwards from Thibaut Courtois. Now, let's try, guys, inside foot curled, okay. But by, by, by moving the right stick, you're going to change the... You're going to change the, the curve. That you are applying to the ball. Oh! Oh! Great save from Thibaut. Messi with a miss with the left. Okay. So let me guys use low pass now. To the far post. 
boom. Oh, yo, yo, Crossy, you added too much power. I love the new mechanics when it comes to corner kicks. It is going to take some time for me, for you guys to adapt, learn how it works and score goals from corner kicks. Oh, I love the new animation, guys. The sliding tackle animations, brand new compared to FIFA 22. That was my first sliding tackle that I, I did in FIFA 23 and I already noticed a difference. Oh! Thank you, goal. Almost. Minute 27. One more corner kick. Oh, chip. Let's chip it. New technique called chip. Oh, easy save. Easy save for Thibaut. But that's a brand new technique when it comes to corner kicks. Mukiele, GG. Let's go, Marquinhos. Marquinhos! Easy save. Boom. What is that? I'm doing something with the right stick, guys. I have no clue what I'm doing, but when I press the right stick, something happens to my player. Nay, nay. Good job, nay, nay. Turn. Oh, that was a cheap shot. By the way, I'm curious. Pretty sure that you all remember the cheap shots in FIFA 22. They were OP, and the cheap shot mechanic was the best one to use if you guys want to score goals. What about FIFA 23? Can you score using cheap shots? Good attempt, but Thibaut Curto saved it. Come on, Verratti. Take it. Minute 36. Well done, Marquinhos. Verratti. Mbappe. Boom. Pass it back. Nice interception there by Modric. Look at my Renato Sanchez, guys, when I press the right stick. Almost. So, for example, now, when I press the right stick with Messi. Look at Messi. I'm not sure what's that. Probably I'm telling Messi to go back and run towards my own goal. That's a new feature. Definitely a new feature, guys. When you press the right stick. I'm not sure how exactly it works. I'm going to find out in the next days. That's a very good pass. Hakimi. Good attempt, but easy save for Thibaut Courtois. Thank you, Varati, for the interception. Let's go, Messi. Leo Messi, Leo Messi. Easy save from Thibaut Courtois. And this is gonna be the end of the first half. So let's enter the second half, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go, man. Come on, come on. Mbappe, Mbappe. Hmm. Let's focus now, Crossy. Let's focus in defense. There we go, Verratti, take it, take it, Verratti, take it back, bro. Come on. Sanchez, Renato Sanchez, let's go, Messi. Mbappe, great pass for Mbappe. Woo! Mbappe with the finish, almost there, almost there. You know what, let me try something different now. From a corner kick, passing the ball to Verratti. No, didn't work, didn't work. Chomeni, Chomeni is going to be so OP in FIFA 23, by the way. Messi. Oh, 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 oh! That was the new power shot technique added to FIFA 23. I'm pretty sure that it is going to be overpowered. Did you guys see the special animation that your player does the moment you perform the power shot? Looks decent. Let's go, Mbappe. Let me try again. Oh, oh! That's the power shot I'm talking about! Man, I almost destroyed the goal with that finish with Mbappe. Wow, superb. Can I do it from close range also? Let's try. Nay, nay. Oh, oh, you can do it. You can do it from close range also, but the accuracy of your shot is terrible. So basically, you need to, you need to abuse it, guys, from outside a penalty box. This is a brand new power shot technique feature added to FIFA 23 that... 
I'm looking forward to learning ASAP. Anyways, let's go back to the gameplay now. Come on, Nene. There we go. Renato Sanchez. Mbappe. 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 Finish shots. Finish shots are still working fine. Just like in FIFA 22 from distance, guys. Basically, you need to use... A player with great finishing from outside the box, great curve like Mbappe, one of the best cars in the game, to increase your chance to score long shots, finesse shots from distance. Offside, definitely offside, 4 0. I'm going to try now through balls, something that was extremely, extremely overpowered in FIFA 22, guys. One second, let me take it. So let's go and perform a run with Mbappe. Oh, through ball. Mm, feels different, guys. I know Mbappe took possession, but one second, driven pass, and that's number five almost. The through balls, they feel different compared to FIFA 22. And you guys know that in FIFA 22, it was so easy to score goals after creating attacks with through balls. Through the middle. I'm not sure if. It works properly in FIFA 23. I don't think it works. Mbappe. Power shot from this. Okay. Apparently, I'm doing something wrong. Probably, I'm too close to the goal. And that's why the, the shots aren't as good as I expected. Oh, look at Ramos. Ah, regarding Ramos, guys. EA just ruined his pace. Down to 60 pace now. Nay, nay. What about now? Nay. No, no, no. Didn't work. Didn't work. Didn't work. Thank you, Mendes. So, minute 70. Bape? No. no. Thank you. Nay, nay. Come on, nay, nay. Come on, nay, nay. Focus, bro. Marquinhos, let's go. Pape. Messi. Messi, you're all alone. Power shove. Rudiger, that sliding tackle, bro. Great animation there. Wow. Love it. I really, guys, like the colors in FIFA 23. S big, big improvement regarding colors compared to FIFA 22, guys. It's, it's not even close, man. Love it. Truly love it. Let's go Mbappe, Mukiele, Hakimi, Messi, Me Did you guys see the ball trajectory went up, then down? The problem was, it was wide of the left post. Imagine if that long shot went in. Just imagine it, man. Wow. Minute 75. Take it, take it. What about skill moves? Let's do some skill moves. Let's go Messi. Wow, okay. I love the dribbling. I love the dribbling. Verratti. Verratti. Didn't work. No. Cross, you don't concede. Pass. There we go, Mbappe. Let's pass the ball to the right. Back, Mukiele. I see you at the far post, Nene. Nah, didn't work. The lap crosses are not very efficient, guys. Compared to FIFA 22. Mbappe. No, AI doesn't let me take a power long shot. Wanna score a goal from distance using the new power long shot technique. Come on, Marquinhos, focus, bro. Nice pass there from Donnarumma. Through balls. Are completely different compared to FIFA 22, guys. Confirmed. 
So we need to find new ways to attack and create goal scoring opportunities in FIFA 23. Overall, guys, the gameplay feels different compared to FIFA 22. Feels different. It's not like you're going to be a good player at FIFA 23 if you guys were good players at FIFA 22. You need to learn the new mechanics. You definitely need to learn the new mechanics in FIFA 23 to become Division 1 players. And this is the final whistle, guys. First impressions on FIFA 23. I like the game. I like the game. I know it's too early to talk about the game because I haven't played enough, but my first impressions, I like the game. On PlayStation 5, new gen, graphics are better, passing, dribbling, shooting feels better, guys. Especially shooting with the new power shots, dribbling feels really, really good. Regarding defending, it's too early to talk about defending. I need to play some games against real opponents online to see how defending works because in the previous FIFA editions we had big big problems with defending especially with AI blocks and so on don't want to mention it anyways thank you guys for watching drop a like if you enjoyed my first ever FIFA 23 episode on my channel let's go over 700 likes and the moment we hit 700 likes I'm going to release my second video guys Tutorial, yes, the tutorial series is officially back. Catch you guys later. Bye bye.